Hello, Man and All Stars. This is your boy Shocker 360 from Man and today I'm gonna bring you a commentator match. First of all, I didn't know this guy was a commentator at all. This guy is Madden Players. You can go ahead and check him out on his channel uh, here on YouTube. But uh, you know, I heard it from Master Chappy saying that yeah, he's uh, real cocky. I guess I'm real cocky against when I play against commentators and I beat them, etc. Anyways, this guy is ranked around 127, I believe, uh, on PS3. But I don't know what happened to this guy in the game. Uh, he wasn't playing like a, a rank 127 player, I believe. I think he was lacking or he was nervous, maybe. You know, nothing uh, dissing him, but just giving him uh, just some good feedback there. Um, but uh, he throws a pick. I run it back for pick six. And then the next drive, he throws another pick. And I almost run it back for another pick six. So... At this point of the game, I'm thinking, what the hell, um, what's going on here? You know, why is it so easy? Uh, I come back on offense, I really, um, as you guys see here, this is from the Arizona playbook, and then I go ahead and audible down. Arizona, Houston uh, are one of my favorites, also Carolina playbook. I haven't done anything for Carolina, but Houston and, uh, and definitely San Francisco and uh, Arizona are my favorite playbooks. So those are one of the ones I use all the time. I mix them around. If I find something new, I try to do use the same concept with all the playbooks. And as you guys can see here, we're again we we'll have the ball 14-0. Uh, he did another turnover, so we're ready to score once again. Uh, Madden players, uh, he's uh, okay. I guess he's been playing pretty good, and I, I see some of his games on his side now that I know who he is. If you guys can go ahead, go ahead and check it out. He also uh, wants to be part of the Madden All-Star crew, so you know this was kind of like a test game uh, for him. Uh, as you guys can see here, it's going to go ahead to the FL screen. And uh, this was a 21-0 game. At this point, I was like, man, you know, it's too easy. I'm kind of going to slack off a little bit, you know. He throws another pick uh, right here. My player was in the right position, and we get the the pick right here for another chance to score. Uh, but I started to get lazy, man. I started to get carried away there for a couple of quarters. You're going to see right now what I'm talking about. And I just couldn't believe that he was trying to make a comeback, you know, in this game. I just didn't, couldn't believe it, you know. So every time you play a game, just keep attack on attack mode, right? At this point, I was relaxed, you know, thinking, oh, man, I'm just going to go ahead and score. But this guy's trying to beast, you know. He's trying to beast mode and try to make a comeback, not realizing that he's ranked 127. So he can still, uh, there's a lot of time in this clock to make a comeback. As you guys can see here, I threw a pick. He ran it back for a touchdown. So... It's all good, 21-7. I'm, again, uh, trying to do my offense, and I'm going to go ahead and motion go here to the left. Streak ball outside wide receiver, the middle receiver on the right, and we're going to wait for the trail, and here we almost get a first down at a second and 19. We get almost uh, 18 yards. FL screen, I'm going to go ahead and throw to the flats. Here I got two fates, almost everybody in fates, I believe. We got a first down, and, uh, again, we're moving the ball. Coming out this time on the fork. Throwing to the flats. Uh, we're moving the ball consistently now. You know, trying to be a little bit more careful this time. And as you guys can see here, I'm going to go ahead and about to throw here. And we get a freaking fumble. Now, he gets a chance to score again with a field goal. I locked him up here. 21-10. So now, I'm two scores ahead. He has momentum in this game. Two-minute warning. I'm going to go ahead and throw right here. He gets a freaking user pick. Gets in front of right, uh, right in front of my wide receiver and gets a user pick, man. I just this guy's making a comeback, man. Whatever you do, guys, if you're winning, don't let down your guard, bro. I started getting lazy. Now I gave away two two scores. Now he has a chance to score again. Now he, this is a turnover once again. Uh, we stopped them, but we get the ball back. Let's see if we managed here to to score in this game. I'm gonna go ahead and throw deep. Nothing. User pick. So right here, I'm just. Now I lost momentum. Now I lost my reads. I'm getting tunnel vision because I relax. And look at this shit. He's down one score now. He could, uh, you know, again score and, you know, be winning in this game now because I decided to be stupid and retarded and let him come back. 21-17, I get the ball back. Uh, this time I'm going to go ahead and go beast mode myself. 
I'm no longer going to be playing uh, soft ball or tunnel vision. I actually shook it off. I did like around 20 push-ups in halftime. I actually paused the game, did around 20 push-ups. You could ask Madden players. You know, you're probably wondering why I paused the game so much. I did like around 20 push-ups, and then I came back and freaking started going on beast mode. I'm right here driving the ball. As you guys can see here, FL drive. Going to go ahead and run it with, with a quarterback. We fumble, but we recovered, man. This would have been the... the <laughs> Definitely my destruction on offense. I wouldn't have recovered this ball. But look at this shit right here down the middle. As you guys can see there, we get the pass. We're going to go ahead and drive. Now, I'm going to give you guys a quick giveaway. First person to comment on this uh, section. Gets, uh... Actually, you know what? The first 20 people that comment on this gets a free guide. A chance to win a free guide. I'm going to actually raffle y'all's name. So make sure you comment. First 20 to comment will be raffled. For a free defensive domination guide, uh, we have some of the setups that we have here that we're using in this game. Some of the guys have been seeing me play with a 416, but uh, we're here driving 2817. Like I said, first 20 will have a chance to win a defensive domination guide. So make sure you guys comment on this section and like it. So let me know what's up, man, what you guys think. But as you guys can see here, look at this. This is going to be awesome. 28-17, I'm up two scores, send the <laughs> send the A-gap blitz right here, get uh, right in front of the tight end, and took his first read away for a pick six. Basically, this is it, man. This is the dagger. Defense brought me back into momentum, scoring another touchdown, and that's pretty much it here. We killed them right here, man. Definitely put the dagger and insert it and, and then spun it a couple of times right there with that touchdown. Look at this shit. Just give me that ball back. This is pretty much it for him, man. Uh, Madden players, uh, definitely need some, need some work there at the beginning of the game. I, I think Madden players were kind of nervous, you know. Uh, played against me there, threw three picks, made a comeback. Was very close to make it happen, but at the end, I made it happen with my defense. And 42-17 is the final score. He decided to call it quits right there. He was kneeling the ball down, so I just decided to let him go. And just send them a message. Good game, guys. So remember, first 20 to comment in this section. You have a chance of getting a defensive, offensive, offensive domination guide. So later, make sure you like the video. Bye, guys.